a new shot in the arm from Saudi Arabia, and at the right time. Electricity cutouts have returned after a few months of stability. The reason is the shortage of petroleum and gas that run power stations across the country. Part of the aid is in petroleum products, which will go a long way in solving the problem. Petroleum consumes over 40 percent of the budget because it's subsidies. The government can't leave subsidies for social reasons. And at the same time, it doesn't have sources to buy energy products. Egypt earlier requested petroleum products from the Gulf state. The new batch follows around $12 billion offered by Saudi Arabia, Kuwait and the Emirates after the ouster of former President Mohammed Morsi last July. The money came at a crucial time. Egypt has been suffering from an acute economic crisis because of daily demonstrations and bombings. Tourism, the main source of hard currency, dropped by over 50 percent in the third quarter of 2013. Foreign investors shied away due to security concerns, while foreign reserves dropped from $36 billion to $13 billion by July. Now it stands at $17 billion. Egypt's Prime Minister Hazim Biblewi will be in Saudi Arabia on Tuesday to finalize the details of the aid package. The flow of Gulf money is also related to Al Sisi's rise to power and the ouster of former President Morsi. Experts say more Gulf money will come Egypt's way if Al Sisi becomes president. Yes, Hakim for CCTV, Cairo.